What is good with y'all, man? So today for Wild Card Tuesday, the Eagles got a new middle linebacker. This is something I've been asking for personally as a guy that uses linebackers. Can we please get another linebacker? They blessed us. They went ahead and gave us Jordan Hicks, who if you guys remember his team of the week earlier in the year, that card was tough. I think I set a record, or at least for me, a personal record. I think I had like four pick sixes with him in one game. So it's good to have this guy back. I did end up selling Patrick Willis, which I don't have a problem with because this Jordan Hicks stats are pretty good. Uh, you see he's got 98 speed, 99 speed. And for you guys that don't know, they did drop a new strat card for the Sugar Rush promo yesterday. All you got to do is play the challenges, and it's going to give you a strat card. It gives everybody on your team plus two speed. So if you got a 50 out of 50 thing team, basically you can get four plus speed on your team, which is Jordan Hicks. I think stock was 94, and now he's 98. So, yeah. He's not going for too much either. I think I bought him for like 240000 so that's a dub. You could probably do a set if he has a set and get him even cheaper. But, yeah, he's 98 speed, 99 excel. He's six foot one. Uh, he's got a 94 player rank. That's pretty big. 93 hit power and a 91 zone coverage. Uh, now his man coverage, I think is pretty low. It's a 79, but I'm not tripping on it. Uh, he looks pretty good ability wise. I'm just rocking lurker on him. He gets that for zero. He also gets outmatched for zero AP. Uh, this might be the first player to get that for zero AP. I'm not too sure. I don't know how much it really works. Having used it, I can't really speak on it. Don't know anyone else that's used it. So, uh, but he also gets a mid zone KO for one AP, so that's a dub. And in his final slot, he gets secure tackle for one, tackle supreme for one, and film study for two. Um, if you're going to go with any of these, I don't know what's better between tackle supreme and secure tackler, but I know secure tackler is pretty solid. So if you got the extra P, extra AP, that's not a bad option. I'm just going to rock the lurker on him. Who knows? I might switch to AP up. So basically, who I'm going to be rocking in the box is I'm going to be using Kaiser and I'm going to be using Jordan Hicks. Uh, when I get that Mike Singletary fully upgraded, I'm going to be honest with you, I don't think I'm going to use him now just because I'd rather use Hicks and Kaiser, who are a lot taller than Singletary. Singletary is like 5'10 or like 5'11, and his AP is nothing special. It's pretty much similar to Kaiser and Hicks, so he's just going to be a special teamer for me. That's just kind of what it is. You guys didn't already know, though, Team Diamonds are going to be coming on Thursday. I would assume we're going to get the reveals tomorrow, which is going to be pretty big. Now, I'm about to be up on two mil coins once this Patrick Willis sells, so I'm good on coin-wise, but you guys are definitely going to want to get your coins up because obviously the Team Diamond Master... He's going to get all the team cams. A lot of rumors going around saying it could be Sean Taylor. I could see that because I definitely want to see it. It's obviously going to be a defender because the first one was offense. And two, I could see it being some type of a cornerback or safety, a DB. So, now obviously, will any of us probably have the coins to get him? Me personally, probably not because he's going to be a lot of coins. But maybe some of you guys will. And that definitely would be a pretty W card. Like I said earlier in the video, though, if you guys have not already, do your challenges. Because if you do your challenges, you're going to get this free strat card right here. A Sugar Rush Boost All Players 2 plus Speed, 2 plus Acceleration, 3 plus Change of Direction, and 5 plus Jumping. Literally, you get this for free. Uh, basically, I just got rid of my free agent card because there's no point. But it's just crazy to think that you can get 4 plus players uh four plus speed on players now which is something we haven't really seen since 21 actually no it wasn't 22 technically yeah, yeah well it was in 22 guy forgot the way it, it did this we thought this would be the first year where you couldn't get extra speed on guys but well i mean it was for most of the year but they folded at the end jordan hicks is pretty much the only change that i've made to the team uh probably since the last team update video i guess the only thing we've changed since then we have changed up some of the uh, ap because if you remember i think i said i was using secure tackler and avalanche on patrick willis the Avalanche didn't last long. I probably took that off a couple games later. And then I even took Secure Tackler off. And what I did was I went with Acrobat on Slay and on Asante Samuel. And it's crazy. It's been uh, very good because they both get it for 1 AP. That's probably the only change I've made, though. And I'm probably not going to make too many more changes because, like I said, I want to see what's going on with Team Diamonds on Thursday. And, well, there's also not really anybody else I really want for the team, too. Like, I'm pretty... Got to understand, man, the Eagles theme team is pretty good. Like, there's not a whole lot you can give us at this point. It's got to be some crazy stuff. Middle linebackers, we still need middle linebackers. So, like, yes, we got this Jordan Hicks, and, and I'm, I, I like him a lot. He's going to be nice. But I want somebody with some even better AP. Like, yeah, he gets that zero AP lurker, but I want to mix something else with zero AP with it. Like, Patrick Willis, you could do that. So, we'll see, though. You know what I mean? A Seth Jordan would be nice. Now, if he gets a card, who goes between him, Kaiser, and Hicks? That's going to be a tough one because, well, these guys are really good for me. I know a lot of you guys are probably like, oh, well, I don't really even use middle linebackers. But I got to say, though, this year I feel like has been a better year for middle linebackers. Now, obviously, you still need to put Lurker on them in order to get them to jump. But at this point in the game, most guys are getting that for zero AP. So it's kind of a dub. But 
Linebackers this year, they do play the run way better than safeties. And I don't know. I feel like they, I'm not, am I saying they animate better? Uh, with Lurker, I'll be honest. They, man, I, I've seen these boys do some things that I've never seen some of my safeties do in the box. So I, I remember there was this play where Kaiser literally completely jumped over. Like a guy was like 6'2, just completely jumped over the guy. Like, I don't, it's not even humanly possible. But I'll tell you, man, I'd recommend linebackers, man. They play really good. You can get Lurker on them for 0 AP. They play good, man. That pretty much is going to do it, though, boys. I just kind of want to make a quick little update video. We picked up the Higgs. Kind of want to talk about some things. Uh, but I'm excited for Team Diamonds on Thursday. If they do end up revealing Team Diamonds uh, tomorrow, which I assume they would. It just makes sense. It's usually what they do. Uh, and then they reveal, reveal a couple Eagles. Then I'll end up doing a video, you know, going over all the stuff like that. So stay tuned for that. But we will be using this Jordan Hicks tonight on stream. So if you want to see me use him live in effect with some gameplay, uh, drop a follow to the Twitch link that is down in the description. Um, I always say I'll try to get a gameplay out. But look, if the guy doesn't make plays or if nothing really spectacular happens, I can't drop a gameplay with him. But if those things do happen, then guess what? We'll drop a gameplay with him. But that is pretty much going to do it, though, boys. Like, comment, subscribe, man. And your boy is out.